Okay, I'm just out here weeding the peppers. We got green peppers, banana peppers, giant peppers, California wonder peppers, red peppers, yellow peppers. Got about, this bed is three foot wide, 16 foot long. Made out of two by 12s, treated from Menards. This bed's uh, probably 25 years old. They'll last a long time. It has no bottom in it. It's set right on top of the grass. Some of these pepper roots go down three, four feet. I was just weeding them. These peppers been in for two weeks. We planted them uh, after May 15th. It's now June 5th. We had to wait till after the frost was gone. So you can see I just weeded this bed. Uh, the grass and the weeds begin to grow. You can see this little section here that I haven't weeded yet. I'm just weeding that now. I come in here and I pull these green weeds by hand. Then I come in here with my cultivating tool upside down because I don't want to hook these pepper roots. I use this upside down like this to scratch the surface and I'm cultivating those weeds out of there. Then uh, after two weeks, I put some 12-12-12 uh, fertilizer, about one tablespoon around each plant. It's gonna get hot out. These are gonna really begin to grow. Some people I noticed this year are saying, can't build any raised beds, they're too expensive. Let me tell you something. Lumber is awful high. These two by 12 by 16s right now, I think they're selling for about 65 or 70 bucks a piece at Menards. To build this bed here, it takes two of them, 16 feet. You gotta buy three 16 footers because you got two on the edge, then you cut the rest. That's three foot, three foot. When you fasten these together, you put uh, three screws in here and two spike nails and they'll stay together forever. Freezing and thawing, they will not come apart. But you can build this bed for about 200 bucks worth of lumber. That seems awful high, doesn't it? Well, let me tell you something. I got 42 pepper plants in here. You know at the store, peppers are over a dollar a piece. I'm gonna get three or four hundred dollars worth of peppers from this bed this year. Three or four hundred dollars worth. We're gonna eat peppers, we're gonna give peppers away, we're gonna freeze peppers, we're gonna have stuffed peppers. What else can you do that you can spend a little money and pay for itself this year? This bed, these raised beds are 25 years old. We've been getting peppers out of this bed like this for 25 years. Four or $500 worth of peppers per year. We use a kneeler like this because it's easy to kneel on and work in this bed. We plant stuff at the end. There's a hosta coming up. They're nice to work in. You can kneel right down here. Work on your peppers. Another week I'm going to come in here and I'm going to put these small tomato cages around these peppers because these peppers are going to get up here over two foot tall. They're going to grow good in here. Just wanted to share that with you. Don't be afraid to buy that lumber and build those beds. Even though lumber's high, now's a good time to do it. Whatever you grow in them, peppers, peas, tomatoes, beans, it's going to pay for itself the first year. And you're going to enjoy them beds for a long, long time. Talk to you later. Bye.